I'm vlogging this trip. I'm headed to either Dallas or Houston. I actually am not sure which one, but I am filming with the NFL, um, NFL Tuesday Night Gaming. We're gonna meet up with two other NFL players, do a bunch of fun stuff in Texas, try some cool barbecue. I didn't really look at the full itinerary, I'm not gonna lie. I think we're going, I don't really know what we're doing. So you're just gonna have to come along with it and figure it out. Because yeah. I got my boo thing taking me to the shuttle right now. I'm all packed up. I just finished packing this morning. I got out of bed like 10 minutes before just to leave. But um, I get an apple, a bagel that he made me. I will catch up with you guys in the airport. Just got to the hotel room. Here is the bathroom. Our here is the little coffee station and mini fridge. And then here's the bed. Well, I need to turn this light on. Here's the room. Just for one night in Houston. I'm pretty sure my view is of the highway. Yes, it looks like it's of the highway. So cool. Just got my DoorDash order. This is what I got. It looks so good. I'm starving, so I'm about to dive in. I got some sides. This is, I believe, like my kale salad. Yes. And then this is the sweet potato fries. Mm-hmm. So good. Here's my apartment that I'm staying in currently. I got some grapes last night from Bucky's. I'm about to eat this morning while I'm getting ready. Okay, wow. Um, I look literally like a hot mess right now, but I just woke up, but I ate some grapes, and get ready for today, shoot day number two. Here's my bedroom I slept in last night. It is a mess. That's the pool, and there's my view. Here is the bathroom. This is the laundry room, but I'm not gonna be doing laundry while I'm here, so. I'm literally only here for two days. And then I forgot to show you, there's one more thing. There's like this little cute bathroom right here too. I didn't get to film literally anything from yesterday. I didn't get to film literally anything on the vlog camera today, or yesterday, because we were filming everything on the main camera for the actual like show, shoot, whatever. But I did get some footage on my phone that I'm gonna do a video with, so. You just have to follow me over there to see that footage. I literally look crazy right now. So really quick, yesterday we went to the Space Museum, we went to Aquarium, and then we went to this place called Truth Barbecue, which had literally like the best barbecue in the world. It was amazing, so good. Um, and then today, and, I, and that was with Devin Singletary, and then today um, is with Darren Woodson, and he is an ex-Cowboys player. Today we are also going to get barbecue, and I think, actually I don't know what we're doing today. So it will be a surprise to both of us. I'll try to get some footage on the vlog camera, but uh, if I can get any, I'll just shoot some on my phone. But yeah. And then the next day, like tomorrow, I'm going to be able to hang out with my friend Nick and his sister and his family. I spent 15, 20 minutes doing my hair, curling it with the freaking Dyson. And I did not brush it out. I literally just left it and it did this. I sprayed it and it was curly. I don't understand. Now I'm gonna brush it out because there's nothing left. But I just don't understand why my hair does not hold the curl. I mean, it looks like fuller, so like that's nice. But it was curly, so I just don't understand what happened there. Anyways, finished my makeup for the day. So I just did something like really light and natural. And then I'm gonna show you guys my fit for the day. I have this jacket, this white little top belt. I got in Denmark, jeans, our mother jeans. This is from a boutique in Auburn. 
and then Nike shoes, and yeah. made it back to the apartment and now i'm just chilling i don't know why the lighting looks so weird right there today was really fun we met up with darren woodson who is a dallas cowboys legend and i'm an eagles fan so i was like damn we're probably gonna butt heads you know but it was so much fun we had great banter and everything first we went to the Puro museum French and it had like dinosaurs, cool like rocks, space stuff. I mean, literally everything. It was just a museum full of so many cool things. Okay, so then after the museum, we headed over to the like tall building. It's like a ball shape and it's like the place where you can see Dallas. What is it? Oh, Reunion Tower. Reunion Tower, yeah. So we got to see like a bunch of cool places up from above it was very very fun he was just like showing me around some buildings his wife designed and just some really cool places in texas in dallas specifically and then after that we went to the pecan lodge and got some amazing barbecue they toured us through the back so we got to see like how the barbecue's made it's literally cooked for 12 to 14 hours the brisket was amazing the ribs were amazing they were packed with flavor so good um i can try to put some clips in of us eating it if i can get them from the team but it was literally so delicious. Now I'm like schlumped. I was gonna go to some shopping stores, but now I'm literally so tired. Like I think I might nap before my friend comes and picks me up. And then I'm gonna go stay the night for tonight and then tomorrow night with his family. Anyways, for now I'm trying to find out what the Wi-Fi password is because like my phone is being weird and it is just like not working. So I was like, I should probably vlog and update everybody on what we're doing. I need to go get my ring engraved. So I got my Cartier Love Band in LA on Rodeo Drive, and I don't know how long I have to get it engraved, but I do know that I still have time to get it engraved, so I wanna get the word everything engraved on it because I love the meaning of the ring. It means um, love and faithfulness, and to me, that's just like God. It's just like my reminder, me, just me and him. So this is like me, him, and Betsy's ring, and then this is just like me and his ring. And it's just me and God's like reminder, you know, um, of his love and faithfulness to me and when I asked him I was like okay so like give me a word to get engraved on there like what you know what word and he gave me my everything I'm like he's like what do I mean to you and I was like you're my everything and then I was like okay that's great like I could put my everything so I went online to type that in but it doesn't fit like the words my everything so I just typed in the word everything and it fit perfectly there's only 10 letters allowed on the engraving and there's 10 letters in everything so that just worked out perfectly and then I want to try to go to like David Yerman and see if I can get like a bracelet there um because I've been trying to like get into wearing like bracelets and the rings and stuff, the jewelry. I got this one from Savarsky in Times Square in New York. And then this, my grandma gave me, I just got it from my mom literally a couple days ago. And it doesn't really fit me that well, but I'm going to see, it's an Omega watch and I'm gonna see if they can fix it at one of the Omega stores if they have one nearby. And then I do wanna get like a David Yerman bracelet cause I'm trying to build a stack on my wrists of jewelry, so yeah. Keep you updated. Thanks. Sorry. Uh, don't go. I can't. Oh. Sorry.